Jonathan Cartwright. I came from Great Britain. I was um, born in a town, Sheffield, England, which is in the middle of England, very famous for its silverware, not particularly famous for its cooking. Is this new one that you've just built right yeah, now? I just built that one right in front. I wanted to be a cyclist and fell into the industry sort of by mistake. I thought, how hard can cooking be? And then realized after a short period of time into my apprenticeship that it really is a hard industry. After my apprenticeship, I went to the Savoy London for three years where I actually came to America on promotion for the first time and thought, wow, that's actually not the country that I thought it would be. I think back in Europe, America was held as hamburger and hot dogs and uh, I was expecting really not to come into such an organized environment and such passionate guests that were really food driven. I think back to my early days at the White Pond Inn, how people came to dine and now how they make it a, a main event. I interpret the cuisine here as uh, American cuisine cooked with European flair. I think we have great roots in the, in the way that we, techniques that we do it, and we have fantastic product. Because you know when you buy good product, there's really not a lot that you need to do with it, but take care of it with love and care and cook it with pride. Maine, I mean, is a fantastic state, and I think the way that cuisine is developing here is just because of all the natural resources that we have here. You know, we have wonderful seafood. We have pristine waters out there. You know, we have wonderful foragers, you know, man that goes out and really um, climbs anything and goes out in any weather and has secret little spots where he picks from it. We have many farmers that come into this area, till a bit of land, willing to plant many, many different things and then find a speciality in that. And they're really passionate about what they're doing, as passionate as the chefs. If you don't start with a great product, there is no chance to make a great meal. You know, we're cooks, not magicians. I think, you know, the uniqueness from the White Barn Inn comes in the package. Quite often, you know, we get compared to Jean-Georges, Daniel, the Inn at Little Washington, uh, Woodlands, other Relian Chateau properties that do a fantastic job. I mean, it's not only all about food here. Obviously, we work very hard on the food. We have a great kitchen team, great staff. We have great suppliers, and we have a passion about cooking it. Uh, I think we have a fantastic front of house team. Their graciousness of service, our service style, our setting in the barn, make it, a, I think, a, a memorable dining experience. I wanted to be a cyclist and win the Tour de France. It's a very similar, it's a team effort. You cannot win the Tour de France as one rider. If the people in Lance Armstrong's team are not willing to sacrifice everything to make him be the team leader, it's the same in the kitchen. Those guys go to battle every night. They are very, very dedicated, very hardworking and driven, and that's what makes the difference.